Ooh, she got her head pop off. That sucks. Filler palette. She's doing good. She's skipping talents. <clears throat> okay. She seems she I think she's a Windows gamer. <clears throat> The reason I say that is because she was chaining pallets together really well. But she it, she couldn't be. I mean, she could. Uh, it could not be window, Windows gaming, but it just feels like it, you know. Ooh, nice, dude. That was so weird. Is he ever going to get a head pop, though? <laughs> yeah, dude, she's definitely Windows Gaming, man. If she's not... That's going to be bizarre. Greedy, greedy, man. They don't have, I don't think they have anything left, dude. I think between Hinatu and, uh... Ooh, that was a good fake, dude. Definitely a good fake. She played that well. <clears throat> now, see, you can see the difference. She wasn't just holding forward to each loop. That's why I, it felt like... Jane was kind of kind of on autopilot, if that makes sense. <clears throat> uh, yep. <laughs> and Nancy didn't have it, so that's like a perfect example, dude. It's like a perfect example. Like you can see it, man. Like all these, uh, like these survivors will say that th this isn't noticeable, but it's super noticeable. You watched, you could watch the gameplay. Like Jane literally. Felt like it was an odd, like she was autopilot. Bam, 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 bam. And that's not to say she's a bad player, because she did utilize like the tiles well. Um, but it was a complete 180 to like Nancy, who was struggling to find shit and if it was dropped or not. Uh, she couldn't tell. So definitely, definitely understand why a lot of survivors run this. <clears throat> it's a solid perk. It's not bad at all. And then I, I see people that are like only only like new or bad survivors get value out of out of windows that that couldn't be further from the truth uh i think any player can get value out of windows of opportunity especially since you'll know one where everything is right and then th then people will make the argument well game sense allows you to do that yeah but game sense also doesn't allow you to see if pallets are down so there's another win it's just a good perk like overall i don't think it i don't think like telling someone that they like they like uh, if they're an experienced player they wouldn't need that it's kind of stupid because if you're solo queue i highly recommend windows of opportunity highly recommend it i kind of think if you're solo queue and don't run it um it can hurt you a lot i'm not saying you need to uh, like have it every match but it will help you get out of your matches more uh and get out like win your chases more
But that was, man, I wish I was recording that and not not having it as a VOD. Because the VODs always look like grainy and shit. Um, I, I wish I could just pull that because that was a perfect example of being able to notice... Um, windows of opportunity is like a super, a super noticeable perk. I like, we just had a match where it was super noticeable too. Um, obviously if a survivor uses it poorly, that's different, but that was a perfect example of being able to notice it. I noticed the Jane. So if you don't know what windows of opportunity is, windows is opera windows of opportunity is a perk where, um, survivors can see all the vault locations and, uh, pallets and stuff on like around them in like 32 meters i think um and so like i said this this jane feels like she's on autopilot which is not a bad like i'm not making fun of the jane it just feels like she just automatically knows where to go right um versus a nancy who was just like kind of running aimlessly hoping for a pallet uh and it just show it shows you the difference in power of that perk pick a killer dvd all right dude pick what you got for me